In this lesson, we will discuss enhancing your website's performance with a content delivery network, or CDN. Before we explain how to set up a CDN, let's define it. A CDN is a global network of servers that caches your website's static content, such as images, CSS, and JavaScript files. When a person visits your site, the CDN delivers the content from the server closest to them, resulting in faster load times. Using a CDN improves your website's speed and reliability because it seamlessly stores your content on multiple servers, called edge servers, rather than the single origin server of your hosting provider. Why use a CDN with WordPress? Using a CDN with WordPress offers several benefits for desktop and mobile users alike. Number one, it improves global reach and reduces delays. With servers located worldwide, your content loads faster for visitors, no matter where they are. Number two, it reduces server load. By offloading the delivery of static resources to the CDN, your web server can handle more traffic and perform better. Thirdly, it increases uptime. CDNs ensure that if one edge server goes down, others will maintain your site's availability. This is known as load balancing. And then fourthly, it enhances security, especially against DDoS attacks. DDoS stands for Distributed Denial of Service, a type of cyber attack that overwhelms your server with too much traffic, causing it to crash. A CDN helps prevent this by spreading the traffic across multiple servers, making it harder for an attack to succeed. Next, how to set up a CDN with WordPress. Let's walk through how to set up a CDN with your WordPress site. Firstly, choose a CDN provider. Some vendors offer free tiers and most bundle other useful services such as SSL certificates and a web application firewall. So do some research to find a CDN provider that's right for your needs and budget. Popular options include Cloudflare, KeyCDN, Bunny.net, Securi and Amazon CloudFront. Please note, if you already use Jetpack, enable its free CDN feature called Site Accelerator. Next, sign up and create an account. Some providers offer a WordPress plugin, allowing you to register for an account right from the WordPress dashboard. Navigate to Plugins, click on Add New Plugin, type CDN in the search field, and install your chosen provider's plugin. I will install and activate the SuperPage Cache for Cloudflare plugin to create an account and add my website to Cloudflare. Back in WordPress, the plugin will guide you through the setup process. The next step is optional, but if you already have a cache plugin installed, it's best to integrate it with the CDN to get the best results and avoid potential conflicts. Let's learn how to do it using several popular plugins. The first one is WP Optimize. The cool thing is you don't have to do anything as the plugin automatically integrates with Cloudflare, ensuring caching works seamlessly with Cloudflare's CDN services. The second plugin is called W3 Total Cache. It has a built-in Cloudflare extension that you need to activate under extensions and then follow the setup instructions. If you use a different CDN provider, navigate to General Settings, CDN, and then Enable CDN, and select the one you wish to use and have signed up with. Next, you can also use Lightspeed Cache for WordPress. It integrates Cloudflare and Quick Cloud CDN. Make your way to Settings, CDN, and here you can enable and set up either. The Quick Cloud CDN option is at the top and the Cloudflare option is available when you scroll to the bottom. You can also sign up and create a free Quick Cloud account under Quick Cloud CDN setup. For detailed setup and configuration instructions, please refer to the official manuals provided by the optimization plugin and CDN provider you choose. In conclusion, a CDN can significantly improve load times, 
enhance user experience, and boost your site's overall resilience and security. It's worth investing in this extra layer of performance. To learn more optimization techniques, check out these two complementary lessons, using caching to improve website performance and website optimization.